right? Fill in the blanks for the following conversion factors, okay? So we're uh, reciting a few conversion factors here, and I give you a little hint. Think about which one is bigger, and that will help you to know what number to put there, okay? So one meter is how many millimeters? Well, milli is one thousandth, okay? So one thousandth of a meter, um, but which one is bigger? The meter is bigger, so it's going to have more millimeters. Uh, so there's a thousand millimeters is one meter, right? One centimeter is how many millimeters? Well, a centi is one hundredth of a meter, and a millimeter is a thousandth of a meter. So a hundredth and a thousandth, you have a difference of ten. Um, and which one is bigger? Again, the centimeter is bigger, so there's ten, uh, ten millimeters. All right. Um, so you can you can see this as uh, ten to the minus two uh, for you know a, a centimeter is one times ten to the minus two meters. A millimeter is one times ten to the minus three meters. So the um, uh, you know the remainder there. Um, or the difference between centimeters and mi millimeters is a factor of 10. Okay, one milliliter is how many liters? All right, well, a milli is a thousandth of a liter. So, and then we look which one is bigger. Well, the liter is bigger than a milliliter. So, um, there's going to be uh, more milliliters in the liter. All right. So we're going to have one thousandth of a liter, or 0 0.001 liter. That's one times ten to the minus one, two, three liters. Okay. And here we have one meter is how many centimeters? Which one is bigger? The meter. And we have centi is a hundredth, so there are a hundred hundredths of a meter in one meter. You can think of it like that. And one megagram, the capital M is mega, um, equals how many kilograms? So mega, that's times 10 to the sixth, or a million, and kilo is times 10 to the third, or a thousand. The bigger one is the mega, and uh, a million over a thousand, and you have a difference there of 1,000, okay? 10 to the 6th um, and 10 to the 3rd. You subtract the exponents and you get 10 to the 3rd, right? 1 micrometer is how many nanometers, okay? Micro is 10 to the minus 6th. Nano is 10 to the minus 9th. Um, where so this is a billionth of a meter this is a millionth of a meter which one is bigger the millionth of a meter is bigger than a billionth of a meter so that means there are a thousand nanometers in one micrometer 10 to the minus 6 10 to the minus 9 that difference is 10 to the third okay all right number 15 Circle the answers that show the units arranged from smallest to biggest. Okay, so um, what this is saying, kilograms is less than or smaller than grams. Mm, no, that's not true. Here's some English units. Tablespoons are smaller than teaspoons. No, that's not right. Millimeters are smaller than centimeters. Yes, they're also smaller than meters, so that one is correct. Uh, here we have liters are smaller than milliliters. No, that's not true. Milliliters are smaller than liters. Yes, that is true. They are smaller. Picometers are less than nanometers. Yes, that's that's true. Nanometers are less than micrometers. They're smaller than micrometers. That is true also. Micro are smaller than milli. 
which are smaller than centi, which are smaller than deci, uh, which are smaller than the meter, which is smaller than kilometers or kilometers, which is smaller than megameters, which is smaller than gigameters. All right. So that whole sequence is uh, correct as well. All right. And uh, here we want to identify each of the following as true or false. All right, so more conversion practice here. There are a thousand milligrams in one gram. Well, a milligram is a thousandth of a gram, and the gram is bigger, so yes, there are a thousand milligrams in a gram. That would be true. There are two teaspoons per tablespoon, right? A little bit of English um, practice there. If you do much in the kitchen, you know there are actually three tablespoons in a, or rather three teaspoons in a tablespoon. That is false, all right? There are a thousand micrograms per milligram, okay? Micro is 10 to the minus sixth. Milli is 10 to the minus three. Uh, the difference there is 10 to the third. The bigger one is the milligram, so yes, there are a thousand, 10 to the third micrograms per milligram. That would be true. All right. And on this side, we have there are 16 quarts per gallon. Well, no, there are actually four. So that is false. And there are 10 centimeters for every millimeter. Okay, well, let's think which one is bigger. Uh, the centimeter is bigger, so every millimeter will have, um, you know, there will be fewer centimeters. So it's actually 10 millimeters in one centimeter. That is false. And finally, there are a thousand micrograms per nanogram. All right, now which one is bigger? Well, this is 10 to the minus ninth grams. This is 10 to the minus sixth. So the microgram is bigger. So there can't be a thousand micrograms in a nanogram. It would be the other way around. Okay. All right. And uh, now this is just a reminder for the back side. Actually, it's supposed to be on the other side. Show your work. Um, I'm not going to give credit for work that isn't shown.